I'm working this one kind of in reverse and going in from the back side, hitting the walkway first. There's just a little strip of shade there. That is most likely where the fish is going to be. This is a really easy dock to fish because it's got a lot of space up underneath it. it. gives you a lot of room for air when you're making your casts. So you could really get up under this dock far. And you need to make sure that you do because you can count on other anglers hitting the outside edges. That's the easiest, easiest place to hit. But getting a bait all the way up under there isn't necessarily that easy. And I like to squat down a little bit, shoot a roll cast up under there. And if I can't really see that good, I'll stay down on my knees a little bit. And I want you to pay attention to something that's going on down here. We've got some ropes up under this dock. And those ropes mean they're attached to some trees, uh, brush piles. So whenever you look up under there and you see ropes attached to the dock, you want to look and see where they go. Because in this case, I guarantee you, they're attached to some good trees that are probably going to be holding some bass. So this dock has got enough space where I can really cast a crankbait up underneath it. This is typically pretty hard to do, but on a dock that's got this much space up underneath it, you can actually get a crankbait up under there. There's spider webs on this side of the dock. I can tell that this spot has not been hit yet today by anybody else. I'll line myself up to get as close as I can to all these, all these front pillars right here. There we go. Go under the diving board. I want to lead that crankbait exactly where you want it to go. Let's switch it up. Let's go to our. Uh, you know what? Let's go to our flipper. Our flipper. Flipper is always good for some bites. A little beaver style bait here. Oh, I guess this this dock is just too easy of a target gets hit too hard. It doesn't have many cross members underneath it. It's really easy to cast to. And uh, a lot of times those docks don't hold as many fish just because it gets more it gets more fishing pressure. Okay. And we go on to the next one. Yeah, I just lost a uh, $20 Lucky Craft jerk bait. Oh, Kobe, 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 Kobe. Kobe's, Kobe's got it! Kobe spinner on. bait! Kobe on the bass bait. Oh my gosh, dude! Kobe oh, on the spinner bait! Hold the shirt. Sure got him. There we go. So I missed that fish on a jig. Knew he wasn't wasn't going to commit to that again, so I'm I'm switching it 